to cover how to collect data from uh, different users just like a google form um, but avoid duplicate entries so uh, google form is a great solution to collect data uh, clapia uh, also has form uh, it's a no code platform to build uh, uh, different kind of apps from web apps mobile apps android ios has workflows uh, it, it has lots of other features but uh, in case you are just looking for uh, a simple form solution that that is available as well uh, google forms does does allow duplicate entries you can't really check whether multiple people uh, have submitted the same entries or same person has submitted multiple times uh, using some particular reference number but with clapia you can uh, can do that so let me show you how to do this so i'll take an example of data collection you can add new app and uh, build an application am i avoiding that uh, so i have already built one application like this where you are collecting name employee id address gender photo and gps location of different employees let's say and uh, i already have one submission where uh, let's say uh, uh, this particular employee ID uh, within the, with the name John has uh, submitted the data. So this is my submission table. Now there can be another John but uh, with a different email ID or employee ID or uh, this John may be submitting it twice. So let's see how to implement that first and then um, see what are the errors that we can give to the users. So uh, I'll go back to this app again and there is an edit app mode. Uh, there are separate videos on how to avoid, uh, how to edit an application in Clapia. I'm just, all right, uh, so uh, this is the employee ID. Uh, let's say I want to show an error just below this employee ID if there is a duplicate entry. So all I'll do is um, just add this validation block type of validation as duplicate there are other validations as well but for this video you we are selecting duplicate checker then there is uh, this one selector you can have a combination as well uh, but in this case uh, we are using just the employee id and uh, say whether it's an error warning or success success will allow submissions uh, not for this case but there are cases where you want to show that there was a duplicate entry and uh, you you will allow it because you want that to happen uh, error will basically not allow the users to submit uh, uh, warning will allow the submission but it will give some error message that okay th there is another entry you can still proceed so let's say i am not allowing this to happen uh, i can select error and then add any validation message so i can say uh, this employee id already exists in the system done so this will start throwing this error if the employee id is already available right let's capture this employee id i'm just copying it we'll go to this app this app is updated now and let's say I add John again. Okay. Uh, so in place of 2010, I add this employee ID and submit. These are not mandatory. So you'll see that it is allowing the submission. But if I add John again, but the employee ID is this one it will say this employee ID already exists right even if the name is same I can add any name um, Tom still it will not allow the submission if you see it will not allow the submission because this employee ID is already existing so this is how you can avoid duplicate entries you can avoid duplicate phone numbers uh, you can avoid a combination of multiple uh, entries so for example um, two people can give different entries i mean they, let's say you don't have a reference number like that but if somebody's name and phone number and uh, let's say date of birth all three are matching uh, and there is already an entry uh, consisting of all these three that fundamentally means that the person is uh, submitting it again so you can have that kind of combination as well 
so that's all in this video uh, you can make much more uh, in Clapia but uh, in case you are looking for a Google form alternative uh, that has duplicate checker Clapia is the right place uh, thank you very much uh, for watching this video have a great day